Hello? Hello, hello, and welcome back. We are going to be starting from where we were in the previous uh, game so that we can get the ending where everyone lives. And then we will be moving on because I fucked up at the last minute and I would just rather get that over with. So that's what we're going to do. Yes. This is frustrating though. Then we're going to have to start from the very beginning. Very good place to start in order to find all the clues, which will be annoying, but it is what it is. I do not. Okay. I didn't remember where this opened up on. The out, the fit. Where the hell are my clothes? You gotta be kidding me. What does he wipe off the blood with? Okay. Gotta find Laura. And me not remember. Don't we should have just gone to the Harbinger Motel. Too late for that now. Going to the dock yet. I gotta wander through the woods. Cause I don't remember what around. going to be exceedingly difficult remember same episode okay might be I'm not looking forward to repeating that sequence
And I remember slide. Figures the cutscene. You can see the other one. This this does not appear thing. I just want to find the last clue. to start the game all over again. But I think this might be long enough to constitute its own video, we'll find out. I don't, I, I have no idea how long the chapter is without This time we're gonna swim across because that's not what we did last time and I want to see what happens. I wish to discover. Was unexpected. <laughs> that, that was not something I was expecting at all. Wow, okay. <sighs> Just totally got jumped. Crazy. Yep, yep. Escapes the audio back. There we go. No QTs, no nothing. That was a bit annoying, but... Great. My favorite. The table, help me. Uh, 
Now I do not remember at all all the pieces of evidence that are in here. Okay. But thankfully well, you can keep looking around and can't get much worse than it already is, right? Great. Just like the cartoons. It's been off and on all night. Gives us a little time. How do you figure? They don't like water, remember? Right. Oh, we should have just been swimming in the lake all night. And die of hypothermia? No. All right, well, we're good now. <laughs> Night's not over yet. These fuckers know we're in here, and they're coming back first chance they get. Great news, okay. All right, we gotta get a vantage point. But first, I gotta do my thorough once more. I don't remember there being anything new here. What the heck is this? I'm a happy, happy bunny! It's not okay. Better. Curious what that would do in some other situation. I know there's werewolf left, so it's kind of one of those situations where I'm like, all right. Ah! Ah! The angles in the room still get... Oh my god. There we go. Frustrating. You were glitching. Remember that. Beautiful. Whatever. Nothing I care about, obviously. Yeah. I know about the videotape. Upstairs in the attic. Put a name to a big mean face. So what, you're like Mr. H's brother, I guess? Who? Uh, the big dude from earlier, when you and Ryan went to the radio hut. Mr. H's brother, I guess? Right, right. Mm. Beep, beep, beep. 
recoveries. Jeez, let's see, really struggling if they're begging for a dollar. Yep, 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 yep. Alright. I don't believe there was anything else in here. I, was, I do believe you thorough. Yesterday. That I did that. Has this guy been here? Whale well, long paintings. time ago. Long enough ago that it was okay to have an oil painting made of yourself. I kind of want an oil painting of me now. <laughs> I I also would like an oil. Keep looking. Maybe I should keep looking. Definitely, but again, we're. <laughs> I already know that this to this room. Go oh, quick, your me.
we have returned and we are back at it got a bunch of stuff no all this jazz and some stuff. Oh, that we're about to get. Poor Ian. Anyway. Some camp mascot to kick it before camp starts. Rip. Mm. Hindsight. Sounds about right. We have a camp mascot? Well, no, we did. But you didn't hear? H hear what? He died before we got to camp. Uh -huh. Bummer. Sad. I didn't even realize there was a sheep. That probably isn't Prologue I ground her. Go upstairs as we slowly trudge up. Alright, uh gimme give gimme give them videotapes. Good ring. Where have I seen this emblem before? What is it? A ring, with a crest on it. Oh, very fancy. You can never pull it off. Sorry. <laughs> Need to be even more thorough next I remember time. Mr. Ada's cheesy ass announcements. Whoa. Careful with that, that's a camp relic. Relax, it's dead anyway. Ah, RIP megaphone. They're looking for something. Yeah, uh, in Chris's surveillance room, he's storing all the footage. I think you might be right. Got my cat with me. Very nice. Now to the other side. Go faster. It's going to be a yeah. It's a hit. Now we go up again. Okay, 
guess the arrow card that was on the side. Is nothing else. Okay, let's get it started. Shoot him or not shoot him this time is the question. Because I was planning on doing something different with Max, but that it just ended up being a terrible idea. Let's go prepare for attack. Every dusk and dawn all through the summer. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. stronger. We're here to lead the way. Fuck meets for life, we're proud to proud say. say. Shout at Stroud and shout out loud. We're hacketeers. <laughs> Two months and you never learn the words? Showtime, motherfuckers. Yep. Then I believe. Um, I don't remember. I think that's what's next. That or it's a car scene. It's for nice. <laughs> Love the times. They always make the game better. Add to the cinematic quality. <laughs> Very nice. So when it decides to load. <sighs> it really is wanting to take forever. <laughs> Man. Absolutely nothing is happening. Isn't it just swell? So, how was your day?
Wow, it really is having a tough time. What is happening? Is it broke? Did we break? That's... It's beautiful. I think we're... I think it's... Steam exit out of that thing again. Where it ain't working. So cannot get take me back to the state. Fascinating. Are we gonna are we gonna do something? <laughs> no. Alright, well we are going to stop it. Hard hard exit because uh that was annoying. We're gonna go back. <laughs> Start it again. See if we cannot actually get something this time. as hell. Spooky. <sighs> we are gonna take a quick breather though.
we are back. Uh, and I left off screen for a time because I did not want to have to make people pray witness to me screaming because we are going to have to repeat this scene again. Great. Solid. <laughs> see where it gives us off so I'm not feeling very confident at least we know where I think we know where everything is I can't say that with confidence but I believe we do okay so thank god we don't have to watch that whole thing again Every dusk and dawn all through the summer. What doesn't kill you'll make you stronger. Nah, good job. We're here to lead the way. Fuck mates for life, we're proud to proud say. To shout at Stratton, <laughs> shout out loud. We're hacketeers. Two months and you never learn the words. Beautiful. <sighs> here we come. Showtime, motherfuckers. Okay, can we please actually load? Are we gonna actually be able to do something this time? There we are! Thank God. You're alive. Yeah, well, don't sound so disappointed. What the hell happened to you? Where are the others? I don't, I don't know, okay? Everyone's sort of everywhere so specific so we need to helpful get safe. yeah sure whatever dude what's up what do you what do you mean what's up look around you're being all weird and mopey no i'm not no i'm not this is it's now really the time kill it don't kill it look, i'm totally fucking fine emma okay why wouldn't i be totally fucking fine well, excuse me for giving a shit. Whatever. Man, how did it come to this? <gasps> uh, Earth to Jacob? What's happening right now? See, I did it for you, Emma. The whole reason we're stuck out here? I wanted to give you one more chance to realize what you're missing out on. Okay. Uh, what the fuck are you talking about? Oh my god, Jeez. The van, okay? The van. I made it stop working for you. Jesus Christ, this whole night, this was supposed to be fun. M. Earth to Emma. Emma, hey! Ow! Jesus fucking Christ! Did you ever stop to think why I broke up with you in the first place? God. Yeah, because <laughs> I couldn't convince you to stay with me after camp ended. Oh my fucking god. I am <gasps> not a fucking prize. You can't win me. Oh, you think I'm a loser? It's not a game, Jacob! Get that through your skull already! Okay, well, do you even care about how I feel? Because I did this for you. Because I care about you. No, you fucking idiot. You did it for you. And the fact that you can't see that is 100% the reason I don't give a shit how you feel. Okay, this is new. Wow, wow that's really cold. When this is done, I never want to see or hear from you again for the rest of my life. Is that cold enough for you? I was never a big fan what of her. What can I do to make this better? Nothing. Jacob, there is no making this better. All you can do is hope you live long enough to take responsibility for your actions. It's 
not long before sunrise. All we have to do is wait it out. Wait it out. Okay, that's the same. Can I wait with you? No. He's gonna say no this time. It's a free country, man. That's surprising. I was definitely expecting more vehemence. Anyways, can we get a new scene? New scene. Maybe. <laughs> Come on, Abby. Keep it together. Not long till morning. <gasps> what was that? What was that? It's freezing. I do not want to miss anything, so yeah. There we go. Yep. Pop it. What the? Get wrecked. <laughs> he do be climbing though. Caitlin, this way. It's different this time. Slightly different. Really? No. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, uh, okay. This is new.
did it. The freezer comes into play. Like when is when is the bunny gonna be relevant? There we go. That's our answer. Don't what doesn't kill. Okay. So what exactly happened six years ago? There was a fire that wiped out dozens of people, and now there's werewolves and a ghost that roams the woods looking for her lost baby boy. Which I've just put together is Silas. Oh shit. It's a long story. No, it's not. There was a fire. Silas the wolf boy escaped, bit a bunch of your family. You failed to stop him. <gasps> Burn. What Silent. happened in the past doesn't matter right now. Uh, it kind of does, actually. We need to know what we're up against, at least. What we're up against is a feral boy turned werewolf for the last six years has avoided being found. <gasps> no matter what we did. Every full moon we were out there looking. Every single one. <gasps> now the son of a bitch is finally here. So what we're up against is my only chance to end this thing for good. So how do you even know where he is? How the hell are we gonna find him just driving down the middle of the road? <laughs> I do love that part. That part is just really funny. Take the wheel! Jesus, take Travis. the wheel! Travis, get it together, come on! WWW. I got it. I got it. I got it. Just get down. He's gotta be nearby. Let's look around. Are you crazy? What are your alternatives? Are we there yet? You're okay. Been better, but yeah. Over here. Got some blood. Leads through there. Crazy. What the hell happened back here? Whoa. This is... This is where we went off the road two months ago. 
You're trying to decide if you should shoot me in the head right now. Go ahead. If that's what you want, I won't stop you. What? Normally, I'd have werewolf's blood cover our scent, but I'm all out, so we're high risk. <gasps> we could be killed. You ready to end this? Let's fucking do this. Yeah, let's go. Go too. That's, that's still awkward. I'm locked in the fridge. Are you gonna? I have no idea what's about to happen. Dylan and Caitlin are safe. I believe this is just loading for the next part of this. The game be, do, be, do be struggling. Do be struggling. Here we go. As we wait. Yep. God damn this. God damn this place has got some uncool vibes. Podcast didn't do it justice. You don't know the half of it. This is where I saw her. Her? I thought she was... I thought Max hit her, but then I was out here and she was something else. Who? The woman. The old woman. She... Glitching. She was saying something over and over again. Her? Okay. I thought she was. We. Well, yep. I thought Max hit her, but then I was out here and she was something else. Who? The woman. The old woman. She was saying something over and over again. Oh my God! She was saying Silas. That's impossible. Who you're talking about? I saw her too, in the run tunnels. It's Eliza Voris. Silas's mother. I think. Who was she? She ran a traveling sideshow called Harem Scarum. Came here six years back. She kept her son in a cage. Called him Silas the Wolf Boy. Died in a fire. Some say she never left. Real question is, hack its core. there are still, I'm still confused how there were sideshows going on in like 2014, which was six years start? from when this is supposed to take place. Really? You're still hiding stuff now? You blew half the head off my niece, Kaylee Hack. One of the kindest, gentlest souls to ever walk this earth. All she wanted to do was help that little boy. 
locked in a cage by that freak show witch. What did she do? I just wanted to help him. Travis. She convinced Caleb to start a fire. It was just a distraction. It's May Bales. Give him enough time to get Silas out of his cage and give him his freedom. <gasps> That's not what happened. No. Because within minutes, everybody was dead. You ever see Hayburn? Liza? Whole crew? <gasps> Kaylee managed to get Silas to freedom. But Caleb got bit in the process. That's why you've been hunting him. Silas, I mean. Every full moon for six fucking years. Some hunter you are. Now is now really the time? It's I don't a, think it is. This is all that's left. Jesus Christ. Man. Any sign? Negative. Damn, I never saw any of this. I didn't even know this was here. Crazy. Close. We must be close. Did you both see, see it too? Kind of wish I hadn't. Same. Crazy. Here we go. I have no choice. What is it? Silas, the dog boy. That must be it. Careful. Ah. <gasps> Fucking Jesus Christ. I do feel bad for him, but I do know now what happens if I don't. What's wrong? What are you waiting for? Shoot, you stupid girl! I do f genuinely feel bad. Please, let's just... Let's just go before we... We have to see him like that in human form. It's too late for that. So what's different this time? Okay. Oh, yes. <laughs> Wait for anything to happen. <laughs> oh. 
Come on. Come on. Give me give me that good ending. Give it to me. Ugh. I don't want to press anything this time because I just see the end. And we're so close. Come on. Man, give it to me. Give me the good end. Pain. <laughs> It really does not want to help me out. Come on! <sighs> it really is temperamental. <sighs> okay. We appear to have a loading tape. Possibly. Possibly something. <laughs> Game likes to make my existence difficult. I'm... Feels very unnecessary. Can we please? Oh, 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 here we go. Okay. Okay. Got... We got something... Something's going... <laughs> ever so slowly. Wait for the... I bet you think you have it all figured out. I bet you think you're fucking clever. I tried to help you. I tried to warn you. I 
even started to like you. Not now, not after this. I will not forget what you made them do to my Silas. I've been with you all night, and I'm not about to stop now just because the night's come to an end, no. Whenever you hear a noise in the dark, a whisper from the shadow, okay. the breath on the back of your neck, that's gonna be me. I'll be there. Now I will never leave you. I'll never leave you. Luckily, you're a video game character. There's some interesting stuff happening, I think. Yeah, we're gonna have to. It's being a little crazy. Alright, we're gonna start it again. <laughs> Come on, baby. Be cooperative. Very just. That was unfortunate. Yes. Please. There we are. Oh no. Still being I weird. I bet you think you have it all figured out. I bet you think you're fucking clever. I tried to help you. I tried to warn you. I even started to like you. Not now. Not after this. I will not forget what you made them do to my Silas. I've been with you all night, and I'm not about to stop now just because the night's come to an end. No. Whenever you hear a noise in the dark, a whisper from the shadows, the breath on the back of your neck, that's gonna be me. I'll be there. Now I will never leave you. I'll never leave you. Okay. Yeah, we did it. We everyone survived this time. Come follow me into a place where fear is gone and worries fade away. Cause it's a brand new day. I've got you and you got me. The sun is bright and the air is free, so let's go.
Sucks for her. We still did it. It's what really matters. Okay, but what happened to Caleb? Yes. Well, <laughs> yeah. Not make, did he not, like, try to make any noise? Yep. Psycho teens charged after summer camp massacre. What do you think of that, Anton? Psycho teens, one of my favorite punk bands. Okay, so I actually have a really hard time knowing if you're being sarcastic or not. I was being sarcastic. Okay, that actually is very on brand. I thought we'd done the whole Hackett's Quarry thing. Not this Hackett's Quarry thing. This what is was this, day. like three months ago? Old news, dude. Anton, introductions first. We are Bizarre Yet Bonafide, oh, no. the podcast of the paranormal. I'm Grace. And I'm Anton. And together, we explore the possibility of supernatural involvement in real-life, everyday occurrences. And that's exactly what they are, real-life, everyday occurrences. With a shadow of spiritual, supernatural occurrences. I don't think... No. <sighs> okay, so... I hope you've got hat insurance, Anton, because I'm yep. about to blow your mind. Did you yep, just we're ask going, if I had hat we're going insurance? Going with the same yes. joke. It's responsible to insure those things which mean the most to you. A hat. Yes. Okay, I know where your priorities lie. Go on. Anyway, there actually is a real reason that we're coming back to Hackett's Quarry. There have been some developments, and I've sourced some information. I remain skeptical, but I'm all ears. Under my hat. 
I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, God. Why? Why are you smiling? Stop it. I hate it. Why? I had braces. I have to make use of them sometimes. You do have very pretty teeth. Thank you. That's something that a lot of podcast listeners might not know about me. <clears throat> so, it just so happens I've got someone on the inside. So, today's episode is going to have a bit of a show and tell vibe to it. Okay. Who do you know on the inside? This the just the same. What? You know someone on the inside? Don't we all have someone on the inside? You know, an inner critic that mm. says, stop doing a podcast, no one's listening. You should listen to that voice, Grace. Okay, well, what I really meant is, let's call it an anonymous donation. <gasps> you know, we're not the only ones who flagged this as a bizarre situation. Someone actually reached out to us. They sent us a package. Did you, you didn't open it. Anyone who, I don't trust anyone who listens to this show. Oh, I couldn't wait to open it. Surprise! Anonymous donation. Okay, you've always promised me since day one of this podcast that if you could see true evidence, you will consider all options, right? Did you not say that? I did say that, yes. I mean, I know you... Knowing for a fact that we would never see any evidence, I did say that. Okay, well, we've been sent information and we need to decide whether it's bizarre or bona fide. Okay, fine. Let's do this. For anyone listening at home, we are about to open a package from a mysterious person who listens to this show. If you are the one who sent us whatever it is, congrats, you got us. Sorry, the tape is just really, really, there's just so much tape on the package. Sorry, can you help me with this? Do you have, like, a key I could, like, slice at it with? No, I don't want you to dull my key. Just use your fingers. But just give me your fucking key, Anton. No. Give me your fucking key. No. Get your own key. It's not like you lock your door. Of course I lock my door. What are you what are you hiding? What am I hiding? Do you not lock your doors? No, I have nothing to hide. You think that ghosts are real, but you don't lock your doors? No, ghosts couldn't open my doors. They could walk through my walls, Anton. Okay, you need to be more concerned nice. with murderers. Take a look. Apparently they found another body. Whoa! You can't just show me a picture of a dead body. You got to tell me before you're going to do that. Okay, then let's take this over. Anton, can I show you a picture of a dead body? No! I can't work with that, Anton. Okay, fine, yes. you. It, it's a dead body. Okay, wh what is this? What am I looking at? It's one of the <sighs> hikers that went missing. Do you remember that? Yes, that's the true part of the story. Yeah. Ed Benson was his name. He was drowned in the lake. Okay, drowned or was drowned? Now you're getting grammatical. I'm not getting grammatical. If you drown, you just went swimming and you drowned. If some, if he's been drowned, then someone drowned him. Well, then I think I implied precisely what I meant to imply. Now, of course, I can't verify this info. Of but... course you can't. What, do I have, like, a history of not verifying Yes, info? it's fake. Okay, but uh, I feel very strongly that he was drowned. Okay, well, do the police know about this? Are the Hackett family suspects? Okay, okay, I like that you are getting into this. Here's the thing. The newspaper says this guy's still missing, right? He looks pretty fucking found in this picture. Okay, yeah, I mean, he's not missing, he's right there, but yeah. why? Why would they say he's still missing? Because it is a conspiracy, a cover-up. Don't you see? They're all in on it. I, I, who is all in on it? The Hackett family? The Hackett family, the North Kill Gazette. I told you I've been suspicious of them from the start. Okay, uh, okay, so there's the one oh, hiker, he's dead. What the about the other part? one? Ann Radcliffe? Still missing. Who knows how many bodies are still down there, though. I don't know. This is pretty inconclusive. I am... Eh. Yes. It, this is the only one. I don't know what it is.
that Silas died this time. I forgot about that. This is the part that makes me angry. Sorry that the guy drowned, but this kind of seems like a big to-do over nothing. Well, or is it a big undo just let it of something, go through which is what again. a cover-up is? Okay, you can't just twist my words like that. Okay, so I anticipated your skepticism, which is why I saved this little gem for next. Finally, you're going to present me with some ghost ectoplasm. Put out your ring finger. I've got a little gem to slide onto it. What do you got? leaked photos from the hiker's camera. Photos that show them at Hackett's Quarry. So? Maybe they were there and then they dropped their camera. It happens all the time. Yeah, they dropped their camera whilst appreciate being that the murdered. newspaper headline and changed. Their bags were I'll found be back too. when it's Oh, no way. Do you have a fake photo of them too? Oh, please. Okay. So you have a picture of bags. These could be anyone's bags. Well, they match up to the ones in their photos from their camera, and they have a monogram of their initials. I think, at least. Or it's water damage, I can't tell. Yeah, okay. That's not nothing. I'll give you that. So, we've got to talk a little more about the Hackett family. Right, so these guys are like the heritage landowners, right? Mm-hmm. Yep. Their great-great-great-grandparents were trappers who claimed the land way back when. They just claimed it? Yes, they did. They put their flag on it just like the man on the moon. The Hackett family flag, right. Well, apparently when they claimed it, they found quartzite. Quartzite? Okay, I was hoping you would ask. Fun fact, every building in the whole of New York is made of Quartzite. That's not fun or a fact. Most of them are. But I digest. Digress? It was a pun. They dug the quarry and hit great heights of success before Septimus Hackett, classic bad guy name, the seventh son of the trappers, the number seven, has great supernatural powers, uh -huh. closed the mine down. Okay, so then they only had the land to live off. Yes, you say only, but this land actually spans acres. That's a lot of forest, a lot of unexplored darkness. Ooh, okay, a great place to hide, to have all these dark secrets for this strange, reclusive family. Mm hmm And this is where we start to get a little more into paranormal territory. Okay, here acres we go. Acres and acres of haunted woods. If you say so. Welcome to Bizarre Yet Bonafide, the podcast of the paranormal. Welcome back to Bizarre Yet Bonafide. Anton, today I'm actually going to pass you some light writing. Okay, you're going to make me read this? Mm-hmm. All right, um, this is... What you're seeing now is a copy of a letter that Kaylee Hackett wrote to her grandma, allegedly. <sighs> All right, uh, this seems like more of a you job, but I suppose right, I can read I this. Right, but I feel like if some of the evidence comes from your mouth, it will have more clout. Right, okay, here we go. Gammy, 
How long we gonna drag this shit out? I know family is the most important thing, but I want to know what's outside the forest, outside this damn house and camp. And I, I think sure I'll just start the recording up again on the stream. About to happen because like, of who we are. I don't. Maybe we can explain what's going on. Fucking show people. Then they'll know we got no control over it. I know you just trying to protect us, but one day you won't be here no more. And right now it feels like we stuck in a dark hole. I can't sleep, Gammy, or if I do, I dream about that fucking fire. We were just dumbass kids back then. I wish it never happened. Love, K, X, O, X, O. That took a turn. Yes. Dream about that fucking fire. Does that not read as the haunted scribblings of someone who saw something that they shouldn't have seen? Yeah, no, I'm fully creeped out. She was clearly going through some stuff. And this is legit? I mean, I don't know why someone would fake it. Then again, I can't verify any of this. So, you've got to suspend your disbelief slightly. Man, this poor girl. Yeah, there was something going on, something eating away at her. And that's what I want to explore. Okay, well, consider my disbelief suspended. For now. So, I don't think that's yeah, going to we'll, be a problem we'll start back up one. the recording. Oh god, why? <laughs> Holy shit! This is a cease and desist letter. And it's addressed to us. 